friends, happy Monday. I hope you had a great weekend and enjoyed the warm weather. I know I spent a lot of time working in the garden this weekend. Today for Maker Monday, we're going to make Play-Doh. I love Play-Doh because it lasts forever. It's so much fun. It's something you can squish and do whatever you want with. At the end of the video, I'll give some tips for fun things to do with Play-Doh. I'm going to do a no cook recipe because then even little kids could be involved in making the play-doh which i think is really fun it takes five ingredients that you probably have already if you don't have any of these ingredients it's okay you can make a dough from just flour and water it'll dry out but it'll still work and it'll be a lot of fun so i'm going to use one cup of flour half a cup of salt two teaspoons of cream of tartar a tablespoon of oil, we had olive oil, and one cup of water. You can also add food coloring or a scent. You could do like vanilla extract or if you have some essential oils, that might be fun too. So, I'm going to combine the dry ingredients and the oil in a cup. One cup flour. A cup of salt, two tablespoons cream of tartar, one, two, and one tablespoon of oil. Okay, so the next part is one cup of water. I'm gonna add my food coloring to my water to combine. We have gel food coloring, but you could also use liquid. This is what I found. Ooh, I like that color. Okay, so now comes the fun part, combining the ingredients. some more flour. Okay, once you've mixed your Play-Doh together and it looks like Play-Doh, you have Play-Doh. Congratulations. There are so many things you can do with Play-Doh. You can use those measuring cups and spoons to play with it. You can use cookie cutters from the kitchen. You can 
use your toys if you have dinosaurs or animals you can plastic you can use those i really like um playing what i call play-doh charades where you make a shape out of your play-doh and somebody else has to guess what you made it's also great if you've got spelling words to you make letters out of your play-doh make lots of snakes um let's see what else like i said if you don't have an ingredient don't put it in it will be fine and i will see you on wednesday for a story the first person to comment can have this beautiful teal play-doh i will drop it off on your doorstep um have a great day bye